pleased, of course, to announce uh, the first Roanoke International Tennis Tournament to be held here January 21st, 22nd, and 23rd of 1972. Uh, Mr. Howard Radford, the manager of the Civic Center, has been very helpful, if not the ingredient that has made this whole thing possible. Howard has met with us a number of times and uh, helped us work out the details of bringing this tournament to Roanoke. The tournament will consist of uh, the three-day tournament of men's singles, men's doubles, and uh, the finals will be played on Sunday at, uh, at 2 o'clock. We have uh, spoken to the governor and his wife, and uh, their plans are to be here and uh, to make the final presentation of the awards. Uh, Mr. Woods, uh, James P. Woods, who uh, is Mr. Tennis in Roanoke, is going to serve as the tennis director and uh, under him, of course, will be the trained linesmen, the trained ball boys, and it's going to be really a first-class tournament. Uh, we are pro proposing a price of $10 per seat for the event, and uh, this is going to be an event that will really uh, be a pleasure to see because the top-ranked players in the world will be here. Uh, in addition to the $10 seat, we're going to have box seats available in units of four, which we'll uh, make available to firms and individuals as they wish them. Box seat holders will have use of a hospitality room that Mrs. Long is now working out with Mr. Radford. Uh, 